This is uh, June 14th, 2023. June 14th, 2023. It's about 3.15, 3.30 in the afternoon. And I finished the repairs. And I've already cranked it up and it was a success. So uh, I've now got <clears throat> a working fuel gauge. And I have an engine that runs a little bit better than it did before. But, uh, let me see, I want to show you how it came out. I, the fuel pressure didn't come up initially. I had to, when you turn the key on, it only runs for like two seconds, so I had to crank it for a little bit to get it to come up. But when you turn the key on, you can see the fuel pressure comes up to around 60 for two seconds. And, uh, I got a quarter tank of gas and when I crank it, it starts right up now. Still got a misfire though, but like I say, I got another CPI coming. It's around 52 PSI running. The spec ought to be turn it on, it ought to go to ought to go to 60 and it did and then it comes back off to 55 but with it starting like this I wouldn't be afraid to drive it on the street sounds a hell of a lot better than it did before with the old fuel pump I'd get a misfire every time I did that Backfired. Yeah, that's a lot better now. A whole lot better. I still plan to get uh, put the CPI in it when it comes, and of course I got to repair that fire damage. But next thing I'm going to do is uh, put some. Uh, going to evacuate the uh, air conditioner and put some refrigerant in it because it's like 92 degrees today and they say with the heat index it's over 100 here in southeast Florida. So, I'm, uh, if you look at my past video logs, you'll see how frustrated I was. Well, we still got to stumble. And I got to put a muffler on here. But I got a uh, rebuilt CPI coming from GB Engineering or GB Remanufacturing, which the way it works is you pull your uh, your CPI out. You call Rock Auto or some other uh, parts geek or any of the people that, that that deal with this, and you get authorization for that to then send them your core. Uh, and then they send it out to a third party, to GB Remanufacturing or AUS or the other companies. Well, this is a significant improvement from where I was before. So thanks for watching. This is Dennis Seatsma, Dennis John Seatsma Productions, Homestead, Florida, USA, south of Miami, north of Key Largo. Thanks for watching. Thank you for watching. I know it's been a long, hard road and frustrating, but it's running a lot better now. So, I'm going to put some gas in it and start using it. 